Hi! So many of you sent me a message, emails, asking me to give my opinion on the RM controversy, whether or not he should apologize, and the proper, in- the right interpretation of the song. For those of you who don't know, he posted a song that he was listening to on Instagram. It was a Frank Ocean song, and some of our brothers and sisters who are Muslim were offended, some were in. Okay, I didn't want to do it in the beginning because it's just a sensitive issue, but because you asked. But first, disclaimers. Number one, if you're expecting me to say which interpretation I feel is correct, I'm not going to say that. I'm not going to do that. Second, I also will not talk about whether or not RM should apologize. So, this is most likely going to be the most boring, (laughs) but level-headed and hopefully most objective opinion that you will hear on the matter. Okay, so if you still want to listen or watch, go ahead. Okay, number one, we do need to listen to both parties. The especially regardless of where you stand, whether you feel that it is offensive or not, you still need you still need to listen to all parties. That's the only way you can get to the bottom of the truth. That's the only way you can get an objective opinion. Shutting down the other side is just going to develop biases. It's just going it's just that's not the way. To basically get the uh, a proper or an objective opinion, that's not the way to f- to form an objective opinion. Um, so you do need to listen to all parties, regardless of how it makes you feel. Okay, number two, there is the truth and there are emotions, and both are important. There's the truth, one truth. <laughs> I know there's like, oh, this is my truth. That's an opinion. There's only one truth. But just because there's only one truth, it doesn't mean that emotions of other people aren't important. They're also important. So we do need to consider both. Next, it this actually is a perfect example of where we are <laughs> as a digital society. <laughs> we always say that we want um, we want to understand people. We want to hear all sides. We want to get to know other people. But the very first opportunity we get to get to know other people, we let it go. This should have been a perfect opportunity for a conversation. Instead, we waged war against each other. There were there were very few people who were trying to start a conversation but most the the loudest voices were the voices of hate people cursing other people insulting other people um it just goes to show that all this claim of wanting to understand people we're either not ready for it we don't know how to do it or we're just fooling ourselves um next this should make us realize that artists will never be perfect for us. No matter how much we like somebody, no matter how much we respect somebody, at some point they will do something that will displease us or hurt us or offend us because we're different people. And they are people first before they are artists. They were raised a certain way. They have their own beliefs. So it will. there will come a time when they will say something that will hurt us or offend us. But we should learn how to look at them as an artist and and first an artist first because that's what they're presenting and that's what they're sharing um so i hope this gives us a very clear idea about that next the voice of reason doesn't have a voice (laughs) there were the most controversial ones the loudest ones are the ones that are being heard there they they are the ones that are garnering interest and attention but the ones that are trying to really pull people together for a conversation trying to just lay down some facts give two sides of the story they are rarely heard because it's boring Hmm? (laughs) that is actually it um five points that we need to listen to all parties second is that emotions are different from the truth third is that this should have been a start of a conversation fourth is that we should realize artists will never never be completely 100% uh, perfect for us and last is that the voice of reason doesn't have a voice so um, that's it (laughs) if I do want to hear your side of the story I will make it a point to closely monitor the comments so that there's no exchange of hate or whatever if you want if you want to give your side of the story just use very respectful words 
And uh, as I've said, if the any sign of attack or unreasonable hate or well, I guess all hate, yeah. But anyway, I will closely monitor the 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 comments to make sure that you can give your side of the story without being threatened or whatever. Okay, um, you can also get in touch with me in any of the social media links that you see on your screen right now. And please don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell. Thank you for asking for my opinion. I really, really appreciate it. I value that. Thank you.